down to the last four. Both teams playing delightful football throughout the tournament, but who will progress to the World Cup final? Stay tuned to find out live here on EA TV. Hello, a very good evening to you. This is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of the Doha city centre. I'm Derek Ray, ready here in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder, Stuart Robson. And we're just moments away from kickoff time in the World Cup semi-final. It's Argentina versus Croatia. Well, this could be an absolute classic, and the prize couldn't be any bigger, could it? A place in the World Cup final. Let's just hope we get two teams that want to play good football and come out and attack the opposition. This should be a good game. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Alejandro Gomez starts alongside Rodrigo De Paul in central midfield. And the lead striker today is Lionel Messi. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Luka Modric plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And so the battle commences. Petkovic and now Perisic oh good defending to stop a decent looking attack Kovacic a meaty but fair challenge and it will be a throw in it needs an accurate cross Kovacic an alert piece of defending and keeping it out. Lionel Messi's daredevil style of attacking could well make the difference here. Oh, Stuart. can he finish it, Derek? And still a chance. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, so close to getting that early goal there, but it was a wonderful save by the keeper, you have to say. Good visualisation and execution. Kovacic. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Looking ball, there could be a chance now. <laughs> Bruno Petkovic. Kramaric. Here's Modric. And blocked for now. Yeah. 
taken short. Well, the cross needed to be better than that one. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Rodrigo de Paul. Fernandez. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. And good pressure high up the pitch. Could be a chance to break here. Defenders need to cover. Well, it peters out, but they still might be able to do something. And give it away. And Messi carries it forward. What's he going to do from this position? Oh, keeper's help with it. Let's see about the delivery. Well, what an opportunity that was. Well, that's a great chance to open the scoring. It's a poor effort in the end. And giving the ball away. Messi. High quality defending. Mateo Kovacic. And successfully cut out. Well, Argentina have really started to dominate the play over the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. Chance here, Kramaric. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. And how about the short corner? Could be threatening. Has a go. Determined defending. Martinez. Giving it a try. Mateo Kovacic. Take it away, he won the ball. Kramaric. And Perisic prepared to fire. Well, the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. Now, potential danger. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Playing it short. Nicely timed tackle. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? In with a chance! And a goal! The opener in the semi-final! First goal of the contest! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plomb. It's a great goal.
match has restarted. 1 0 here. He's got space. Mateo Kovacic showing a lot of guile there. Good defending in the end and danger averted for now. Moving forward effectively. Defended well. And the whistle is sounded for half. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Long way out. Oh, really hit with venom, and off the woodwork. Well, that's a great shot. He just hit it with such power. I'm not sure the keeper would have got that, you know. Enzo Fernandez. Oh dear, not a great effort, was it? Modric. And Perisic takes it forward. He has teammates he can play it to. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. There's a slide draw pass. Can't miss, surely. In it goes. Delighted to be two in front. Things look good for them now. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but woeful defending. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Look at Modric. Kovacic! And a decent save. Full credit. And in by Luka Modric. Well clattered away. Modric. On to Perisic. Kovacic. The keeper more than equal to it. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Elects to go short. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. He has teammates around him. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And in with a real chance. Oh, a moment of pure class. Unbridled joy for him and the supporters. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Three goals without reply.
Kramaric. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. And he finds the net. No difficulties encountered. Well, when you see this again, the goalkeeper has to do a lot better. It's a penalty straight down the middle. How he doesn't save it, I just don't know. So back underway. 3-1 the score. Well, he was keen to give that one a go. Sadly, lacking a bit of accuracy. Well, we're highlighting Lionel Messi for a reason. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders out there, Stuart. Well, you won't see too many better performances than this. He's been an absolute menace to these defenders today. And, of course, he's taken his goals really well. Perisic. And he read it well defensively. into the final 20 minutes and they need to get tighter here and space to cross it well he didn't miss by all that much well he struck it quite nicely but the keeper was always in control of the situation he knew that was going wide Juranovic crossing possibilities now there to intercept and now a corner coming up and the substitution will occur now who can he pick out well still an issue here and I think the threat has been averted applying vigorous pressure and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. So a personnel change then. Luka Modric with the corner. He can't hold on to it. Tremendous block. Now defenders having to cover up. Well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Marcos Acuna. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Really closing him down. Messi. Messi. Now delivering that deep cross. And getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, as you can see, he's first to react, he's first to the ball, and he deserves his goal. That's an excellent finish. a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now Ivan Perisic oh he fancies his chances not the easiest of situations for the keeper and in by Luka Modric Nicolas Otamendi under duress. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it petered out. Andrei Kramaric. 
Now Brozovic. Well, spot on with that challenge. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Flag raised for offside. Perisic. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Not enough cut and thrust, but they keep possession. Let's fly here! Well, after that attempt... And full time here! Argentina will be taking part in the 2022 World Cup Final. Well, what a display that was. Their attacking play was breathtaking at times, and they completely dominated in midfield, which then allowed the fullbacks to get forward to great effect. They'll surely be favourites going into the final.